Yo ho ho, what is going on guys, Steph, and we're back on the Madden Ultimate Team 16 coin game, and today we got a 75k coin game going up against 40 Puppet 2160 caught me in the stream and said, hey Stiff, let's play for 75k. I said, aight, let's do it. It's actually his captain, uh, Kyle Long versus my 75k coins. Uh, he's got Ty Law, Andre Reed, Joey Porter's 90 overall team. Very good, looking like a stacked team. <clears throat> we are as well a 90 overall team. So it's looking like it's going to be a very good matchup going up against this guy i i assume that he's a subscriber on the youtube channel it may not be but if you guys want to get a game in just make sure you guys contact me at the stream twitch.tv slash madden daily if we go live or on uh twitter at madden daily or get at my gamer tag which will be in the description looks like he's got the cardinals on offense and the patriots defense so we know what to expect actually because that's the majority of the good players that want to play run these playbooks especially Patriots on defense because that is a very popular book so it's looking like we're rocking with those Bears uniforms I promise you guys I do have some other gameplays coin games coming up with different uniforms on so these are just recorded in the past so and he's rocking with the Cleveland uh, Browns playbooks and look at this first play of the game we tried we knew it was man coverage we tried doing our setup didn't really work out first play gets picked off by Ty Law what a start to this game I cannot believe it <laughs> awful start but second four he's dropping back and just tries lobbing it up and we are in man coverage are of our own and can you say give me that one time let's get it baby Randall comes up with the huge pick so it's basically a wash I throw a pick he throws a pick we all throw picks everybody along hey <laughs> but anyway, second and three, we end up dotting him. We got some man beaters out there because that's exactly what this guy is in. He's in a lot of man press, so that is what we got to have to adjust to. He sends heaters my way, second 18. Uh, we're just lobbing it up to Keenan Allen because that seems like the best thing, and we aggressive catch it all the way down to the 10-yard line. We come up huge. Oh, Keenan Allen comes up huge. And then we just cap it off with Reggie Bush, Reginald, Reginald Bush uh, with the touchdown. So we get the, the, the first score of the game. And we do not get ball at half, so we got to remember that as well. So it's basically a wash. He threw a pick, I threw a pick, and then we end up scoring a touchdown. Now, let's see what he can do on his drive. He's hitting over to Gronkowski. He's got that flashback 91 overall Vic with that, like, 93 speed. But on a fourth and five, he tries playmaking, and we get the deflected ball. Do not end up getting an interception, but we get the turnover on downs, which is exactly what we want. And then on a first and five, we are going to cap it off with... Uh, Davis, I forgot what his first name was, and I'm not starting this recording over. But anyway, right here, second and ten, he's rolling out for his life, running for his life, and throws an absolute dime to the right side of the field. Gets two feet in, and probably did the possession catch. That was a dime by Michael Vick. But we basically got what this guy wants to do. Third and eight, we send heat his way to the left side. We end up getting the stop. Fourth and 16. I cannot believe this guy is going for it and he's dropping back. And get you say, give me that two times. Let's get it, baby. DRC coming up huge. And let's see if we can get any more return yards. But we end up not doing that. And man press is definitely giving this guy a struggle. It seems like he's running man press on me. I'm doing pretty okay with it. I'm running man press on him. He's not really doing all too well with it. But 4th and 16 is definitely hard to beat. Especially when you got man press. Not a lot of man beaters out there that could really get that. But on his 2nd inches, he sends heat my way to the right side. I swear I thought I blocked it. I mean, I put the guy into the line and I hiked him. Thought he would have gotten the, uh, he would have picked up the blitz. But for all you haters out there, this guy's sending the same exact blitzes that I'm sending him. The only difference is, is I'm blocking 90% of them and he's not. So I don't want to hear in the comic session, like, stop sending blitzes. He, it's unfair. He's doing the same thing to me. I just know how to stop him. So 17 0, definitely looking great. Uh, he gets ball at half. This is the kickoff to halftime. Definitely just have to try and lock in, just keep playing our game, and then we will be 70k coins richer. So second and 10, he's going deep, but can you say, give me that three times, let's go, we lurk out here. Definitely come up with a great user play. Uh, I don't think he was getting hit while he threw that ball, but right here, third and four, he sends another B-gap to the left side. I, again, I put my guy there to block it, and he just totally disregarded the blitz. Uh, a little upset about that, just because I put my guy, I motioned him into the line, which should stop it, but he just disregarded it. But anyway, we almost lurk it with our defensive lineman right there. We almost lurk an in interception. Third and 10, he's dropping back to the left side. He's trying to get rid of it, but we hit him just in time for the incomplete pass, and it is going to be fourth and 10. He's dropping back. We hit him with another quarter's 
heat. And we get the turnover on down second and 11. We're rolling out to the right and we hit Odell Beckham with the possession catch in the end zone. And we go hit that whip one time and we go up 27 nothing in danger of the 21 point rule. But he goes deep. He caught me on a corner. Caught me on my cornerback. He goes deep. I couldn't recover enough in time. Good play by him. But now this is first, uh, first and 10. He's rolling out right. Playmakers to the left side. Now that's some shit right there. And then some more shit. He just falls right into the end zone. Still not down. <laughs> he's still not down. <laughs> and he's going to try and go for the two-point conversion to get some momentum. And he ends up getting the two-point conversion with Chris Johnson. So he's coming back. Maybe. Who knows? He might get that ultra comeback. But right here, he's just whiffing on some hit sticks right now. When we got Davis coming up the left sideline for like 50 yards right there. And it's going to be first and 10, and we are looking pretty. We got Reggie Bush coming off the right side, but we get smacked, and he ends up picking up the fumble. Damn, damn, damn. This is definitely looking like a comeback. Second and 10, he's rolling out left. We tried sending some heat his way. It didn't end up coming in. He picked it, uh, picked it up. He playmakers Gronkowski gets the broken tackle and he is getting an extra five to ten yards on that And he's definitely gaining the momentum of this game But we got to stay true to what we do and what, we, what we've been doing for the rest of the the first half of this game And right here look he, he gets stupid with Michael Vick He tries rolling out juking people left and right fumbles But obviously he recovers it because why would I get a fumble recovery after someone doing something stupid? But anyway, that's not the point that's not the point of this video, not for me to complain, it's for me to play by game and try to make the adjustments and see fit and win these coins. <laughs> so second and 10, he's just or dropping back, rolling out to the left side, gets like four yards. Third and six, he ends up doing a nice little inside zone. I played it wrong, I thought he was gonna cut it to the outside. Very good play on his part. And first and 10, now he's gonna go out to the outside and uh, definitely switching up his play calling on his runs. Definitely got me off guard. But first and goal, check out this hit. Check out this user play. Boom. One more time. Just one more time because it was so sweet. Quarters defense. Boom. Just lay in the wood. We took this man's poor soul out of his body and ripped it out from underneath him. And we picked up the fumble recovery because we deserve it because that was a great user play. We hit the gap. We smacked the shit out of him. And then we took the ball right from him. But anyway, we ended up punting the ball. I just wanted to take away his timeouts just because I was at the two-yard line. I didn't want to risk a safety or a fumble or an interception. So I, I just took all of his timeouts away. Or not all my all of his timeouts. I took it all the way down to the two-minute warning, I should say. And then look at this. Give me that four times. Just throwing off his back foot, not making any good reads right there. And we're going to end up sealing this game because this guy has three timeouts left. But he's just going to say, Stiff, I had enough. This man coverage is too much for me. You're lurking everything that I'm throwing. I'm just going to quit the hell out and be respectful about it. At least he just didn't turn off his Xbox and throw it out the goddamn window. He gracefully quit out, just like I always be saying. <laughs> but anyway, guys, that's going to be the end of the video. We are 70k coins richer. Here's the offer. I get my... Captain Kyle Long, we put him on the auction block for 75k coins, and that will be the end of the video. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe for some more coin games and wager action. I think you guys enjoy these a lot, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.